Hi, uh, did you have a lot of fun experience making this movie? How was that? Yeah, it was, it was such an amazing experience to get to work with Mark Waters and Daniel Waters, the, the writer of Heathers and the director of Mean Girls, two of my favorite films. Yeah. Um, just that in itself was so exciting and then to have a really fun cast and to be in England to make the movie, it was all really just it, it, it was so incredible, everything that was happening, that I found it really hard to believe what was going on. And were you always attracted to this vampire romance, this like uh, supernatural kind of genre? Or Yeah, I love supernatural. I've been an alien and a mermaid in, in past roles, so I seem to be really attracted <laughs> to the supernatural genre and the fantasy because it's just so exciting to get to be something that you, you can't be in everyday life. Mm -hmm. and. One thing I loved about the vampire was the kind of the, the dark edge of it right. and and the kind of the magic and the power and the and the mystery of it is is really exciting, even though it's in this film it's offset by a really sort of taking the vampire thing in a nonchalant kind of way, like, yeah, we're vampires. <laughs> Meh. So your character is like the popular girl in school. Was that kind of like your status when you were going to school? No, no, I was like <laughs> I ha there were 250 girls in okay. my grade, so it wasn't like, of course there were lots of groups and there's bullying between like the cliques and everyone goes through lots of hard times in high school. Um, yeah, but I, I guess I, yeah, I wasn't popular, but I wasn't unpopular. I was just cruising. <laughs> so your character has that ability for the compulsion, you know. Um, it kind of what it, it basically kind of you can make someone do. Yeah, the way that because to act that you ha I had to sort of find a way of making it real for me. So I would kind of imagine like going into the other person's mind and and using my powers to kind of twist where their <laughs> mind is. I'm trying to do it to you now. <laughs> and if you had that ability right now, how would you use it? How, how would I use it? I guess I would try and find mean people and make them nice. Oh, really? Yeah. You have to be kind to everyone now. So after, so after all the vampires, the romance, and the action, is there a lesson there for uh, you know younger audiences or just people in general? Is there a lesson for this, from this movie? There's lots of lessons. I think um, the the power of friendship is a really important one because Rose and Lissa are there for each other no matter what crazy stuff is happening through high school and especially when Lissa, when my character gets really high on this this power and she starts to kind of lose control of herself and, and her emotions and, and go to a really dark place as well as hurting people around her, it's um, Rose who's, she never judges Lissa for that. She's always there and she waits for Lissa to come back and and calm down eventually and I think that's a, that's a true friend to you know, no matter what your friend's going through, to understand and having this amazing understanding um, is a great, a great lesson for, for young girls.